Hello everyone, Alok here. So in this video, we'll be discussing about real-time test automation dashboard. So most of the time, we do all our test automation stuff. When I say stuff, it means execution using Jenkins server. So we have several jobs created for several types of journeys, right? whether it's a smoke journey, whether it's a regression journey, whether it's a broad journeys, etc. So uh, the main issue that I was facing is uh, like uh, let's say if I would if I want to check the current status of my test execution so I have around thousand plus test cases in my regression suit I'm running the regression suit so it's gonna take some time so instead of waiting for that time for all that job on Jenkins to get completed and then getting a consolidated report uh, I just wanted to know the uh, status how my automation tests are performing currently so uh, for that purpose, I've created this utility. This is uh, basically created using Kibana. Kibana, uh, for those who don't know, it's it's an open source tool generally used for monitoring and visualization of data. Okay, so you can create uh, uh, several types of visualizations and very they are very easy and they're very intuitive uh, for the data that you have. Okay, so let's jump on the demo. Okay. So. <clears throat> so this is my automation dashboard uh, that I have. Let me get started. Let me make it a full screen. So as you can see, this is completely blank as of now. So what I'll do, I'll click out of fresh test or state. Okay. Basically, I'm executing a Selenium test using headless browser or in a headless mode. So you can see tests are getting executed here, but actually no browser is launched. So what I'll do, I'll wait uh, for the status uh, for their execution, and then you can see their status on this dashboard. Yeah. So yeah. Now you can see that one test case has been passed. We have this count here, the blue section, and <clears throat> we have the test case name here. We have the test case status here, and the count and Accordingly, we have this graph here. So as you can see, it's getting changed on the real time based on the past and failed scenario. So <clears throat> the logic that I have implemented here is that once um, a test gets passed or failed, you can say when a test gets executed, what I'm doing, I'm just uh, uh, posting the data of its, I mean, the data when you can say uh, its name and the status on the elastic search. And then I'm, I've created a visualization, which is uh, 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 based on that, the data that I've uh, uh, shared on the Elasticsearch Elastic server. So once the test gets passed, I'm, I'm pushing that uh, status on the Elasticsearch. And then I'm using Kibana to query that data and create a visualization. So this is what uh, I've created. And it has around nine scenarios out of which you can see it are passed. Yep, so we have all those nine scenarios passed. So this is just uh, SK details. And uh, you can see here five are passed, four are failed. And again, you can see the screen one is five and its percentage is 55.56. And then this blue one is failed, which is 44.44. Yep, this is what I was talking about. This is a real time test execution dashboard and it's quite simple and it's good for real time monitoring. So, yep, thanks for your time. Thank you.